Hey, Tiffany Kent here. Today I want to talk about something that's counterintuitive, why failure can be good. A few years ago, I found myself in a tumultuous relationship with the investment business. Stressful nights, endless worries. I felt like I was in the wrong place, on the wrong stage. So I decided to change the script. My first act, diving in to create a quinoa nutrition bar company. Imagine me with no background in cooking or nutrition, trying to whip up a business from scratch. Next, I ventured into building a business practice website for my daughters. But here's the twist in the tale. Each of these ventures, though not a success, guided me to a vital realization. It wasn't just that I wanted to create a tangible business. It was about something deeper, more profound. You see, sitting among all men on the trading floor, I felt a sense of loneliness, a void. In my lowest moments, I found the seeds of my new perspective. I embraced the risk, pivoted my trajectory, and here I am now, not just an investor, but also a financial advisor. My true calling, I discovered in hindsight, lay not just in the numbers and charts of investing, but in the rich, valuable lessons of connecting with people, understanding their stories and their dreams and their fears. It's all about building relationships, offering guidance and being part of a community. That's where my heart truly belongs, and that's what led me back to finance, but with a newfound purpose and perspective. My failed ventures, they weren't just missteps, but they were actually stepping stones to a more fulfilling path. Sharing this roller coaster story of my career journey with you all is not just about storytelling. It's about showing that life, much like investing, is never a straight line. There are highs and lows, and sometimes the track just seems to disappear. Remember, when you're investing in something, be it in time, money, or dreams, the return might not be immediate or obvious. Durability plus time equals compound growth in finance and in life. So my friends, embrace your failures, learn from them, and keep moving forward. Until next time, remember, the world of finance and life, the greatest returns often come from lessons we least expect. That's it. Thanks.